This is the greatest job on the entire planet because it's truly the only job where you can tell the most horribly disgusting, embarrassing stories about your life, and it actually helps your career. Welcome to Blue Collar, the next generation, which basically means I'm out of a job. I just went home to New Hampshire, and I got a chance to drive around my hometown, and I saw my grammar school, so I parked there, and I just stood and took it all in. I learned such a valuable lesson. Middle-aged guys are not that welcome around grammar schools. I knew at a very young age I wasn't gonna get much out of life, because I was uh, breastfed by my dad. He drank a lot, so it tastes like a white Russian. To this day, if I have a white Russian, I'll burp, fall asleep, and crap my pants. It's ugly. Don't, don't buy me one. I named our team off constantly. At least every time we lost at the end of the game, the other team had to run around the field celebrating like, we won, we beat off constantly, we beat off constantly. I like sports, but I got chunky and forgot to play them. Why is everybody's dog so big? They can't ever control him. Then they make excuses for him. He's just playing. Oh, well, I'm just bleeding. I know. I'd be more dangerous with pepper spray. Because the leaves with a gun, I'd think about it. like, ah, yeah, yeah, all right, go on, lady. Pepper spray? I'd spray everybody with that stuff. I'd use it all the time. Excuse me, sir. Yeah, I think you're in my parking spot. Yeah, I have my blinker on back there. Oh, you were here first? Well, shh, yeah, look at that. Now your eyes burn. Oh, you didn't see my blinker? Well, now you don't see. Blue Collar Comedy, the next generation, right here.